What's up guys, Pointbox here, and welcome to my $600 gaming build. Um, this is a budget build, so it's not going to be anything overload like an Intel processor. But uh, it's going to do the job, it's going to be a great PC for you guys. So let's go ahead and get into it. For the CPU, I went with an AMD FX6300, 3.5 GHz, 6 core processor. This isn't going to do anything like live streaming, um, probably some light video editing and some uh, recording, like some games and running some games in the background. Not anything um, extremely processor intensive, but it will do the job and it's great for budget builds like this um, as it is $100. So uh, now to get to the motherboard, I went with an ASUS M5A78LM USB 3 motherboard. Uh, this has four um, RAM slots, which means you can run, um, I'll go ahead and get into the RAM in a minute, but uh, the four RAM slots um, and uh, it's just a good motherboard for the price. It is $59 in Newegg right now, so I figured I'd put it into this build because it's a great motherboard. All ASUS motherboards are great. Um, now going on to the RAM, some Corsair Vengeance 8GB RAM. This is two sticks of 4GB RAM, so you can put two sticks into the motherboard and you'll have two RAM slots left, which means uh, you can upgrade to 8 gig or eight, sorry, 16 gigabytes of RAM anytime you want. This is some DDR3 16 megahertz, um, megahertz RAM, so yeah, it's some good RAM. Um, then with the storage, I went with a Western Digital Caviar Blue, one terabyte drive, hard drive. Um, and this is a pretty fast hard drive. It's going to suit everyone well. Not as fast as an SSD. Can't put an SSD in this build because it's a budget build, of course. Um, and with the GPU or video card, as some people may call it, I went with an F XFX Radeon R9 280. Um, this has 3 GB of RAM on it. Or not RAM on it, just memory. I don't know what to call it on a um, GPU, but... Um, this comes with F XFX's uh, dual dissipation uh, fans, so it has two fans on it. It's going to keep the mm, graphics card cool, and uh, yeah, um, with the case, I went with a Corsair Spec um, 01 Red ATX case. Um, so it's an awesome case. Um, it comes with some fans with it, so you don't have to buy any fans on the side. Um, and I believe there are enough... Uh, fan sockets or whatever you call them fan slots <laughs> I don't really know fan ports on the motherboard or whatever to put um, how many fans are on this case um, so yeah um, with the power supply and with an EVGA 600 watt 80 plus bronze certified power supply went with a 600 watt mainly because uh, this PC can be upgraded and you won't have to um, upgrade the power supply if you wanted to upgrade um, anything else like uh, this is an AM3 plus socket motherboard, so you can go ahead and upgrade the CPU if you want to something like an FX8350 in the future if needed. And uh, yeah, you can upgrade the graphics card in the future if you need to. And uh, with a 600 watt power supply, I think that it's, it's ready for the future or whatever if you want to upgrade it. So yeah, guys, that was a $600 budget gaming computer. Um, this should run any game at 1080p. Um, and uh, it's just a good PC if you wanted to start a YouTube or something. So yeah, it's a great PC. Um, I highly recommend building it. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Please go ahead and leave a like. And uh, I'll see you later. Bye, guys.